what is going on ladies and gentlemen it is your boy hunter x here bringing us a new video today and uh, this one is um it's a quite heavy one if i'm gonna be honest i understand if you don't want to watch this you can go ahead and click off um it is a bit of a heavy video so i mean i would really appreciate it if you would just watch it through and hear me out um i, I want to have a conversation with you guys my audience my viewers uh, that includes my twitch viewers as well people who watch me over on twitch as well are included in this video um i've been in a rough spot recently um and i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna sugarcoat it it's been about the growth of both channels uh the youtube channel and also my twitch channel and also my other social media platforms that i don't post on <laughs> quite frankly i'm being honest um honestly the truth is and honesty is 100 you know the way to go here and i'm just gonna you know say it as it is how i feel and you know obviously i've been not feeling the best over the past week or so about the channels and everything going on and my situation so i, I mean i guess this could apply to all you know all the years that i've been doing this uh so to speak um yeah it, it's been rough recently the past couple of days and i feel like my mod team can vouch for that i've you know voiced myself to my mod team now it's my now it's time to face you guys as a whole and let you guys know what the hell, what the fuck's going on um it, there's a lot of anxiety there's a lot of self-doubt and this and, and this in this all together right i've lost the reason why i love making youtube videos and lost the reason why you know my purpose basically right it, it it's partially because i have okay let, let's start here actually i have a, a better place to start so ever since i was a kid you know we i haven't been in the best like best situations right uh financially and all that shit. however there's a lot of anxiety in me and i have a lot of you know issues mentally anxiety paranoia things like that so it's hard for me to get a job so before anybody just you know harps on like oh just get a job it's not that easy for me at least it's not and you know i have a lot of anxiety of you know being in a stable home and you know financially stable it is what it is i'm gonna admit it. it it is that's what it is and um it, it it's hard right and also you know when you're constantly thinking about that every day trying to make content on top of that and also like i've noticed that yeah um, my, my youtube channel is starting to grow and i really i i, I don't think i don't appreciate you guys because i fucking i so fucking do and I've always been appreciative since day one when i when i first clicked that go live button it's been an amazing you know i've had my ups and downs it is like everyone does it's just be the part of being a youtuber a streamer and a social media influencer or whatever you want to call it right you, you have your ups and your downs uh you know ever since i hit affiliate i've noticed that my channel has come to a halt uh, especially on twitch um youtube is slowly starting to grow and also part of me now making this video is anxious about posting this video because now that i'm starting to see that growth a little bit it makes me hesitant to make this video knowing that i'm doing something different which is going to drive you guys away right so that's the problem right but the initial reason I reason why I started making content was because I needed an escape. I needed an escape from what was going on in my life initially. And obviously it's still it's still happening. I still got a lot on my mind and all that shit I'm dealing with. But you know, now that I'm a creator, I want to be able to do that for you guys. And it becomes hard because I don't know whether if my content is giving you guys value enough or if it's viable like maybe i can you know my my best friend for 10 years uh this was this was like about a year ago i'm not gonna tell the full story but if you guys want me to tell the full story i will 
um but yeah she's like you just need to be honest and tell your story and uh, you know i haven't done that because a afraid to and b i don't know it, it, it just doesn't feel right right but regardless back to the back to what i was initially talking about um oh i almost died i almost killed a family right there um i lost my train of thought fuck me this this sucks i don't want to do this because I, I all i want to do is just post upbeat and happy videos right you know because there's a lot of dark shit happening in the fucking world right now we all fucking know it it is what it is we've got corona we've got a fucking pandemic happening like the the one thing that i just want to do is be able to make content that people enjoy and that they can just forget what the fuck is happening in the real fucking world because that's what i wanted before i was even making content right i just wanted to find somebody that i can tune into every day and just forget for 30 minutes or an hour forget about you know my life right so that's where this whole idea came from initially and then you know over time i think i just lost that and i started focusing on numbers and i started focusing on views and you know monetization and that brings me to my next point because i'm a bit stuck and afraid to push boundaries and change up the content because i know a lot of the people who watch my videos are here for minecraft and that's also partially true for when i go live on twitch it's like i want to i want to branch out into other games and play other games and make content but there's that little little me running around inside my head saying like no like you're starting to grow on this don't fuck it up kind of deal you know what i mean so here's what i wanted to come to you guys and i almost fucking died jesus fucking christ um i wanted to come to you guys and voice my thoughts and how i felt and that way we can be together and that's, that's another thing uh, another reason why i started making content as well is because i just wanted a family i just wanted a place you know what i mean a, a place where everyone could get together and just have a good time and you know whether you know like say for instance someone needs help with something like one of us we could help somebody you know what i mean it's hard to explain what's in my head <laughs> um as an end result this motherfucker almost cut me a motherfucker <laughs> um uh where was i i just fucking lost i lost track again son of a bitch adhd don't mind me but yeah so i just wanted to kind of like make this video voice how i feel but also ask you guys what what do you feel about the channel what do you like the most like wh what what is what is it about my channel that you like the most what do you want to see me do more of wh like you know even topics that you guys want to see me talk about or you know do research on so that way we can talk about it together that's obviously but let me you know before everyone hops to hops to junk on politics i won't do politics because that's the exact opposite of what i want because you know when we talk about the politics you know everything just blows up it, it just you know and then everyone starts arguing and this i don't i don't like politics but like if it's something like say for instance like elon musk's new net worth goes down by 14 billion dollars in one day and you, you guys want to talk about that let's talk about that stuff like that i'll talk about the tech industry the gaming industry you know you know nvidia's new 39 what is it the 30 30 30 900 or the the 30 39 or the 30 39 jesus whatever it is the new nvidia rtx the 3070 or whatever the 3080 3090 like let's talk about it you know and also like you know i, I just want to 
it's hard to explain again it's hard to explain like what's in my head and you know what it, part of me the more I'm, I'm i'm talking here it makes me want to upload this video because i want to get your feedback and i want to i want to change for the better and i want to work harder and get that that million subscriber plaque and um and and this also not to fuel my ego i've always wanted to win something like win an award for for something for doing something in my life you know growing up i was shy i was quiet i had a lot of anxiety and things so i didn't really participate in school events or anything like that um i just didn't like it and now that i'm 21 years old and sitting alone and making youtube videos wow that's such a i'm such a sad sack of shit. and there's another problem that i have i i self-doubt and also i uh what is it called i, I forget the fucking name of it it's like self something self-sabotage i'm like the king at that like i will immediately reject myself every time and it's very evident in my content if you just watch me live i do it all the time like it's like every five minutes i'm always saying something about myself that isn't true or or whatever i forget what it's called oh self-deprecation that's what it is that's what it is ah! i just killed that family that family is now dead so and i'm also dead because you know this car is very low but guys in the comments there's a few things that i want you guys to kind of um answer for me or answer these questions um and i want you to be as brutally honest i if you if you want me to get off the face of youtube that probably won't happen but you know at least make be honest about it right that's all i care about is honesty uh from you guys like i want i want to know like what do you guys want to see from me moving forward um you know whether that be and and this is actually a perfect point that i'm gonna bring this up um do you want to see a face cam i have been against face cams on youtube videos for a while now it's not that I just don't like the way I well, was for one. I'm self-conscious of my looks, but also two, I feel like if I have a, like a webcam, it takes away from the video, right? It takes away from the experience of the game, so to speak. Um, you know, I've had this internal battle for a while since I've actually I did. I used to have my webcam on all the time and obviously i have my 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 webcam on when i'm streaming it's a little bit different but for videos i've always felt that my face would ruin the video right like and i was about i i was about uh, if i'm gonna be honest i was about to self-deprecate right there but let me know like do you guys wanna you know do you guys want me to put my face cam on for example um, you know, maybe that would make you feel more comfortable like you're actually, you know, you can connect with me in, in a way um, If that's something that you enjoy uh, You know and also games like what games you want to see me play what videos you want to see me make um, You know, I don't Here's the thing. Let, let's stick to gaming for right now. Let's grow game on gaming and then you know, I might down the line I might down the line, you know, start making lifestyle videos and stuff like that, right? You know, you know, a couple of ideas here that I'm just gonna kind of like bring out here is like, do you guys want to see my morning routine? Uh, do you guys want to see like, what do I do after stream? Do you guys want to see the behind the scenes of making a video? Like, I can film all those videos if, if you guys want them. Uh, I'm not opposed to them. I, I don't mind uh, filming those videos and also just let me know what other games you guys want to see I mean I've got probably like 50 60 70 games that I can play and you know that's other than Minecraft obviously again I want to bring more content to you guys 
the, besides Minecraft Let's Plays, you know, like for an example, I was gonna do a Pokemon Emerald, uh, a Pokemon Sapphire Nuzlocke, and all that kind of stuff. Like, if you're interested in that, let me know. Again, like, I think at this point, I really just want to engage with you guys and figure out what you guys want so I can make it and make it happen, right? It, I think it, there's this, 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 this thing. It's just like, um, one of my friend's dads told me, uh, if you know Valenian anyway, his dad was like, you need to play what the audience wants because you're a nobody until they make you a somebody, right? It's something along the lines like that, right? So I think this is the year. This is going to be my year where I'm just going to say, fuck it, balls to the wall. Let's make a different, a bunch of different type of content and see what works. Now, don't get me wrong. Minecraft is not going anywhere. It's not. I am simply in love with that game. I will forever always play it. But I think the more we, the more we kind of think about it this way in terms of like marketing. I guess you really you do really need to niche down right and I, and I know I've done that with just playing Minecraft but also like Minecraft is a huge game and also you gotta think about it this way too I'm competing against people like hypno mumbo jumbo SS Sunday Craner you know you name it like there's some pretty big names in the minecraft community or were in the minecraft community right who are making videos now so it's hard so like you know bring other games to the channel i wouldn't mind it it won't be as it won't be every day like you think it would it's gonna be in between right it's not gonna be like every day it's gonna be every other day on top of minecraft right so minecraft will always be there for you minecraft love you minecraft lovers but i'm saying like bring other games to the channel maybe even vlogs for example if i have something to do like say for instance go to a doctor's appointment like i did today as of the time i'm filming filming this video i went to a doctor's appointment i could like vlog that and what that was like you know during the pandemic season you know what i mean there's like an endless amount of stuff that i can do and you, you just got to let me know. You just got to let me know and I will do it. Um, and, and, you know, let's talk about goals. I think we, we need to set up a goal for ourselves, right? And I think this is, this is very important. I think we should set a goal. And obviously, you know, we're on our way to 300 subscribers. We're going to hit it. We're going to hit it, guys. I know we will. I believe in you guys. Um, you know... It, that you know every moment counts and um you know i think we can hit i think we can hit a million subs in three years i think we can do it with the current time that we have okay that is uh 1000 and something days from now from today we can totally do it i i know we can i believe we can and it, like I like I told my friend, um, my friend Ashley, it's baby steps. We're gonna have to do it in baby steps, and that's just I guess that's just the way I need to I need to think about it. In a way, it's like, you know, PewDiePie didn't get a million subs in one day when he started. Right, he started from zero. And he grew slowly, and then that slowly, that, 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 the, you know, that, that 50 a day, that 50 subscriber mark a day, right? 50 subscribers a day turned into 100, 100 turned to 1,000, 1,000 turned to 10,000, 10,000 turned to 100,000, 100,000 turned to a million, right? So I think that's what, that's the way I just need to think about it. Baby steps. Yes, I've been doing this for five years, and I've only gained 271 subscribers. But that's my fault. That's that's my fault. Uh, I'm gonna take 100% responsibility for that. And also, you know, my Twitch chat. 
my Twitch chat, not my Twitch chat, my, my Twitch channel. It's not me voicing. Like I didn't voice. I didn't talk to you guys. I didn't get in. I didn't get. Uh, I didn't engage. Stuff like that. So now is more than the time than ever. You know we're in the middle of a fucking pandemic. Everyone's at home. You know what a perfect time to voice my concerns, and we can, you know, figure it out together and fix it right fix my wrongs and you know it is what it is but it's not i don't want to make it about me i never wanted it to be about me it never was meant to be about me um it's about you guys the subscribers uh you know i just want you guys to be able to come here every day you know at 2 p.m which that's another thing that i we'll, we'll talk about that some other time but you know, I'm really enjoying making this video now. I think it's really helped me get a lot of weight and burden off of my chest, but also like I'm just having a good time driving, cruising around, talking to you guys. You know, that's what it's about, and, you know, making content and, you know, taking our minds off of what the fuck's going on in the fucking world right now. You know, what's going on is a bunch of fucking bullshit. And we all need that escape. I think we all need that escape, you know, especially teenagers, man. I I saw something on the news the other day about, you know, teenagers who, you know, you know, teenagers that are very social are becoming more and more depressed because of isolation and having to stay home because of the pandemic. And, you know, you know, I'm thankful that I'm not in school anymore, but also I feel for those kids. You know but i was like i was like them like what they are now i was like that in school you know no one wanted to hang out with me no one wanted to talk to me but that's also because i had extreme issues and i'm not gonna go into that because that's extremely personal but still <laughs> we got way sidetracked there but you know that's why i'm here i'm just here to provide a place for you to escape whether you're 16, 34, 99, I don't fucking give a fuck how old you are. I just want you to have a good time. You know, whether that's me playing Minecraft or me raging at Valorant. I, and that's another thing that I'm, I'm scared to, to do that because I'm scared of that change. And also, you know, I don't know. It... it <laughs> I, all I know is I wanted to make this video to let you guys know and also let my my twitch viewers know where I was in my head and you know where I'm at currently and what I want to do to fix it you know whether you know you know I was thinking about taking the rest of the month off of streaming because like maybe I just can't do it right now with my my headspace but then I thought I was like no I can't do that because that's gonna hurt the channel so I, I've come to a compromise with the whole streaming thing. I will stream four hours a day, five days a week. That's 20 hours of streaming. And I want to be able to engage with you guys on the YouTube comments. Again, like I said, I want to know everything. I want to know your thoughts. I want to know your feelings. I want to know what you want me to play. What, what do you want me to play? Do you want the webcam? Do you not want the webcam? Do you not want the webcam? You know, I think it's that time that we just have that conversation. And just and we we grow together as a as a one as a family but also as a community and um you know that way also you know the bigger we get the more people we can help there's there's a lot of stuff that i want to do that i can't do by myself you know you know part of what i wanted to do when i hit that like that threshold like let's say that threshold of me making six figures hundred thousand dollars a hundred thousand dollars a month that's a lot of money don't get me wrong it's a lot but you know i have so many ideas so many big ideas i mean i don't want to share them because then y'all mother sneaky motherfuckers can steal them but you know there's part of me that like there's a lot of you know again like i said this anxiety of having a stable home and stability in uh financial uh, situations stuff like that but you know obviously there's a lot of people who are on you know less fortunate than i am 
yeah, I, I, I'm able to live with my parents and be able to do this full time. You know, like, what if I didn't have my parents? Where, where would I be? I sure for wouldn't be here. I can tell you that right now. So there's part of me that wants to, you know, help the homeless and, and all that stuff. And, you know, obviously I can't do that alone. I'm an antisocial little bunny. Like, I hate socialization, which is kind of funny. I hate socialization, but I'm on social media. That It makes no sense, right? But regardless, you know, being able to get out there and help the community. And I encourage you to go do that as well. Don't just, like, because of me. Go out and, you know, help, you know, a homeless person. Get, get them a cheeseburger or something like that. I think, you know, and, you know, especially times like this where things are hard, you know, things are very hard for a lot of people, especially homeless people. And, it, and it's sad to see, like, when I see, like, the homeless people around my area, it makes me sad. Because, like, knowing that they don't have a, a warm place to go or don't have food or, you know even worse you know they can get they can get covid you know what i mean it, it sucks it breaks my heart and you know with this youtube channel i never i never want it to be about me you know it's gonna be a little bit about me right because i'm the content creator you know what i mean but at the same time i want it to be a community thing you know i want it to be like oh like the hunters tribe you know that's what we're called uh, that that's 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 what we're called we're, we're we're called the hunters tribe for a reason because we're a tribe we're a family and we're you know meant to stick together and be there for each other and all that kind of stuff but yeah so that's my thoughts on the whole like what's been going on and you know i, I if you got through this entire video just thank you i i, I greatly appreciate you listening to me babble on and babble on and you know halfway you know partly repeat myself like seven billion times you know you're, you're my true rock you are amazing thank you for watching this video it means a whole lot to me and again like i said just voice what you think uh what you want me to do like how you feel about the channel what do you like all like your thoughts your, your opinions whatever i want to hear it so we can make a change together and slowly grow and then that way we can make an impact on the world and dead um that way that way we can make an impact um that's my ultimate goal is to make uh an impact um but yeah guys again like i said make sure to uh leave me your thoughts leave me your your ideas uh you know whether if you want to see me use a face cam or not or what games to play and also just let me know like if i add any value if i add any value to your life you know what i mean like if i've added any value to your life what what do you like most about the channel what do you like the most about me as a content creator and all that kind of stuff it would mean a whole fucking lot to me so that way i know like what i what i should do next what my next move is and again let me know if you want to see me play more games i mean it's really important to me this is really important to me this is all i got so i mean yeah with that being said guys thank you so much for watching today's video i know it wasn't lighthearted like my normal videos are but um it is what it is it's something that's been on my mind for a real long time and i thought i would share and let you guys know what the fuck's going on so to my twitch viewers uh, you know, I'm sorry. I had to cut my streams. It is what it is. Um, you know, I am forever grateful for you guys and, and all that stuff. And, you know, I will see you guys on Monday. But for the YouTube audience, I will see you guys again tomorrow with a more lighthearted video and uh, all that fun stuff. But, yeah, again, just leave your thoughts in, in the comments and I'll try to respond to everybody and and, and, and all that kind of stuff. But with that being said, make sure to follow me on all my social media. Those will be linked down in the description down below. With that being said, I'm going to love you. I'm going to leave you. Until next time.